hey guys and welcome back to my channel i know it's been like so long since i put out a video but i am back i've always wanted a vanity but i could never figure out how to make it work in my small space so i decided to go ahead with a floating vanity concept um, i will say that i'm very happy with how it turned out if you like this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe and follow me on my social media so thank you for watching and let's get started all right of course we have to start with our supplies you're going to need a drill a level to make sure that it is straight not crooked some screws this includes some anchors the lag shelf from ikea and then some wall brackets because the lag shelf can only hold about 40 pounds so i wanted to make sure that it was going to hold up now you want to make sure that you measure um the shelf the lack shelf this is you can see me here like making sure that it's even making my lines so that it's not crooked i have been known to put a bunch of stuff up and it's just been crooked and now i'm just leveling off the directions are going to kind of walk you through it um the shelf is about three and a half feet so you want to make sure it's three and a half feet but then you're also going to use the um hardware that they give you to make sure that it's kind of quote unquote floating even though this one technically isn't floating because i did use wall brackets underneath um and here i'm just putting in the screws the hardware for the shelf basically what you'll find is that the um Hardware is basically going to tell you where you need to do. And the directions don't really say, like, put a screw here, put a screw here. It doesn't say that. So it's kind of at your jurisdiction. So I kind of counted down where I wanted my screws to be. And then I marked it with my pencil. And I did it on both. Now, you want to make sure that the screws aren't too close together or they're not too far apart. You want to make sure they're kind of evenly spaced. So that's what I did there. I also decided that I wanted to bring the shelf down a little bit lower. I felt like it was too high so you could see my pencil marks here. And then I decided to take it down a little bit lower, which I'm so glad I did because it just fits perfectly. Um, the reason why I did this is because I was gonna have a, I have a high stool that I use as my chair, the one that you see in the picture there or the video there. Um, and I use that as my chair. And I'll be even reupholstering that to make and it'll sort of have a little bit more um, cushion but here I'm just finishing up screwing in what needs to be screwed in and then kind of calling it a day um, it honestly is that simple I think I've done this a couple of times now and I can do it literally in like 15 minutes it's that easy but for those of you that don't have a lot of space and want to have your vanity it is possible because that's what I did here with my floating vanity I also decided to go ahead and put some um, brackets underneath to make sure that it was holding up that's what you see here I'm not confident with the lack shelf 100% because it kind of leans but that's the budget and here is the final look I I'm really, really happy with how it turned out. I cannot honestly be upset. Um, the, comp the total vanity alone was just about $15. So not that bad. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.